Yeah, good morning to you, Craig. And these crimes, uh, these crimes are looking to separate dollars from the tourists who come to our city to enjoy it. We're talking about pedicabs, illegal vendors, and last night the NYPD was out here with a major crackdown. You can see they confiscated several dozen pedicabs, loading them onto a flatbed to take them off to the pound. The issue here is they are either unlicensed or they are charging exorbitant fees. When people get out of that cab, they're hit with massive price tags. Also, the vendors, they're not licensed. They're selling illegal goods. And basically, the mayor, the NYPD, saying that this is not at all the way we want to welcome visitors to our city. They called this Operation Front Door, vowing to crack down on the things that not only annoy us, but fleece us from the funds that we have in our pockets, the illegal activity for so many tourists can be confusing and unwanted. They take advantage of our guests, our tourists, when they come here, and that's something that we're not going to tolerate. As tourists, it's not comfortable for us when they are approaching all the time and asking us to go to any corner and like offering, suggesting us some bags, watches. We didn't, don't even know how to refuse that. Operation Front Door uh, means that, that we're going to ensure our welcome mat of Times Square is the front door of our city, uh, tourism industry, and we're gonna show people that this is the best place to come and spend time. Another issue that seems to be plaguing a lot of people are these open air drug markets where people are reporting that there's drug activity going on in their midst, and the NYPD did indeed say they've got a number of open investigations into that as well, and they are looking into tackling those too. We're live this morning in Times Square. I'm Kirsten Cole, Pix 11 News. Craig Vanessa to you.